Hey, welcome to the channel, everybody. We here to uh talk about the day, the, about the unfortunate demise of Yo Gotti brother, uh Big Jug, and we got a video today by the Lionel B Show, and so let's get into it. What's up, peace? Welcome back to the Lionel B Show. It's your first time tuning into the channel. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe on the videos, man. Also, make sure y'all click that notification bell button so anytime I drop a brand new video, y'all be the first ones to get it. Now, peace, breaking news, man. It appears that Gotti's big brother, Juke the Boss, has actually been killed. Now, guys, you remember he was initially connected to Young Dolph's murder, and he was subsequently arrested. Now, y'all remember Young Dolph got killed back in November 2021. Yeah, long live Dolph, man. One, now it's apparent, man, that the streets of Memphis is on fire as Yo Gotti's big brother has been killed. As you know, the feud between Young Dolph and Yo Gotti started in 2014 when Dolph actually declined Gotti's offer to sign to him as a label collective with CMG. Yeah, the two that. rappers actually exchanged shots on social media and diss tracks, accusing each other of being fake and jealous. In this track, Play With Your B, Dolph raps, you went from my biggest fan to my biggest hater, begging me to sign with you, but I had too much paper. Now, the beef escalated to violence in several incidents, such as when Dolph's SUV was shot up 100 times in Charlotte, North Carolina in 2017, and then Dolph was shot and wounded in L.A. later on that year. Both times, Gotti affiliates were implicated, but later cleared of the charges. However, one of them, Howard Keon Wright, confessed to the shooting and received a 14-year sentence. Now, Big Juke was not convicted of any of the crimes related to Young Dolph's murder. He was arrested as a suspect, but released on a half a million dollar bail. He was denied any involvement in the case and claimed that he has no connection with Govin. He also said that he has nothing to do with the feud between his brother and and Dolph, and that he was focused on supporting CNG artists and successes. Furthermore, his brother Yogati clarifies that the few in an interview in the Breakfast Club, me and my homie never had one argument ever in life. Touch each other in life. We never exchanged no money ever in life. Now, it's definitely crazy, man, that Big Juke has been um, actually killed. And a lot of people are saying, man, it is in direct connection to Young Dolph's murder. So y'all will definitely make sure I keep you guys posted on any updates that comes across. Y'all let me know how y'all feel about this. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe on the videos. Yeah. Let me see how I feel about it. But yeah, rest in peace to um, Big Juke. Man, but you know, you know, people gonna feel how they feel about him, you know. But yeah, rest in peace to him. You know, it's a, it's a sad day, you know. But yeah, man, we gotta do better, people, man. The black community, and uh, we gotta do better. You know, I know, you know, both sides. You know, you got CMG, you got Young Dolph side with uh pre and you know how they feel about each other but it's like man but if the killing keep going on man it's like when is it ever gonna stop you know one person could kill another person from this side but it's like the few it's just gonna add fuel to the fire it's just gonna make things worse and worse and you're like man I'm just you know when it's gonna stop but it's like man we gotta look look at each other what i mean by that is look and he look in the mirror at ourselves, you know, look at ourselves in the mirror, you know, before we point fingers at anybody else, you know, we can say this and that about somebody, you know, how how they doing, you know, how they go, how they life going or whatever. But it's like, man, you got to look at yourself. You got to look at the flaws of yourself. You know, everybody have to sit back and look at themselves and see what they doing wrong, you know. And that's one thing about the world, man. Everything moving so fast. You know, people ain't sitting back, you know, taking a breathing, you know, sitting back thinking about what they doing. Everybody just moving here and there, you know. And that's why I think things are going the way they going, you know. People need to just, you know, take a breather, sit back for a second, you know. But besides that, about Big Juke, man, you know, whatever he had going on in the streets, they're like, man, 
Rest in peace to him, but it's like, man, you read what you sow. Whatever he had going on out here in the street, if he were finessing niggas, whatever he was doing, it's like, man, I don't know what he had going on. You know, it was just word around, you know. I don't know exactly, but it's like, man, you read what you sow, you know. Shit happened out here in the street. You know, when you out here in the streets and you doing shit, you know shit happens. So it's like, man, you know. Besides that, man, you know, I'm going to show love to both sides. So, you know, long live Dolph, you know, rest in peace to Big Jug, you know. But besides that, that's all I got for you guys today. So, you know, like the video and subscribe to my channel, you know. And that's it.